Van made. On deck. Let's go. Hey there. We have an, a request for From Now On. Uh, I've chosen the official version, the official video. So that brings me to a point I want to make real quick. And that is if you make a request in the comments uh, and you don't care which version I pull, that's fine. Uh, but... If you want a particular version, either describe it to me or send me the link, and I'll play that version. I see there's a live version for this, um, but I didn't know about the quality of it, nor did I know if it was the preferred version. So let's go with this one now. If you like the live version better or a different version better, let me know in the comments, and I'm not proud. We'll play it again, okay? The se secondly, that brings me to my second point, and that is, this is not technically a first reaction. However, I've probably only seen this once, and I'm sure it was at least a year ago. At the time that I started going through Bandmakes catalog, I was a baby metal fan. I still am, obviously. Uh, so I was spending a lot of time on baby metal, and then when the idea for this channel came up, which was about six months ago. I stopped watching any new videos. So there's a lot of the catalog I haven't seen for both Bandmade and Baby Metal and many other bands. But there are some I have seen. I think I've seen this one. It showed that I played it on YouTube, but I don't remember it at all. So for me, technically, <laughs> this is not a first view, but it is in my mind. So let's go uh let's go let them rock us out. I absolutely love this band. Here we go.
I was smoking. Oh, I mean smoking. You know, I don't go out of my way to look for um, instrumentals, but I've seen a couple by this band, and I could listen to them all day on instrumentals. Don't you love the look of their videos? I mean, I know they've done different ones, but um, I watched, uh, I think it's on the channel too. Um, I think it was Dice. The clean white background where all of the instruments and all of the costumes and, and, and all of the amplifiers and sound equipment and drums all stand out like they do. I, I think that's such a great look for them. So, from a technical standpoint, this is how I feel about Bandmate. <coughs> it's not really even a technical sound. I'm not a technical guy. Um, I'm more of a performance guy. Uh, and I love to watch them perform. They have all this energy that is just, you know, over the top. And I don't know how they do it. I watch them play live uh, at uh, Lala, um, Lollapalooza in Chicago, I think is the video I saw this year. I know it was hot. I don't live all that far from there. And I remember it was hot when that festival was. They're wearing all those clothes on stage. And I think to myself, how do you do that? You know, I can remember coming off stage. And I mean, I was a skinny guy back then. So, I mean, you know, but I came off stage and clothes drenched. Uh, first set, the lights. You know, what you're doing up there, all that. So anyway, <clears throat> enough of that. I just, uh, I also want to throw something out there for y'all to think about. Uh, first thing, I'm going to put, start putting a lot more, a lot faster of this band up here. This is one of the bands I wanted to showcase when I started this channel because I I think they're um, way better than people think they are. And I don't mean the fan base. I know the fan base knows they're good or they wouldn't be fans. But I just think in the music industry, they should have a much larger profile than they do here in the West. Because for me, and I'm just going to say this, they, they have all of the earmarks of the Beatles. Prove me wrong. Their song composition is constantly shifting. They do everything from acoustic work to metal to hard rock to jazzy sounding stuff. I mean, look at Manners. Look at that song. That's an incredible song. With all of the things that get thrown into their vocals and the flavor fills on the, on the percussion, all the flavor stuff thrown in, in every direction that it's like when they sit down to write, they write the bass song just like the Beatles did. And then as they went along, you know, recording, they said, let's add this in here and let's, and let's uh, move this over here. Cause it takes away from this and let's keep shifting stuff around until we get this very unique song. I think they have all the earmarks of the Beatles in in that way, in their songwriting, in their arranging and I want to throw that out there for you to think about, to comment on. I could be wrong, but I'll keep thinking it anyway because they really remind me of them. Uh, I watched the Beatles shift from 1963 to 1969 in ways that kept baffling the rest of the music industry. And I'm trying to figure out why these ladies are not baffling the rest of the music industry. Look at... The difference between warning, manners, thrill, and this song are light years apart. So tell me what you think of that. <laughs> anyway, there it is. From now on, I wasn't expecting it to be an instrumental, but once again, like I said, I love anything they do. I, I have not heard a song by Bandmade yet that I don't like. So, 
There'll be a lot more of them on the channel. Throw your question in the comments. Thank you for being here and watching. I appreciate it very much. If you see a thank you button down there, could you hit it? I know it's Christmas. Don't worry about it too much. But if you can, I'd like to kind of get a new background, upgrade a few other things here that will help me put on a better show for you. Thanks a lot. I'll talk to you later. Bye now.